it's Saturday the 13th of October. It's just after 9am and I've just dropped Madeline off at dancing and I'm just about to go in to my first dance school of the day and um, see all of my lovely customers. Um, I'm vlogging but I'm not sure whether there's going to be a vlog today if that makes sense. If you're watching this then there will be. Um, but I think as you can tell I'm not really very well at all today. Um, I've got up this morning. I haven't had anything to eat yet. I'm really really not hungry. Um, so I thought was, I didn't even want a coffee this morning. That is not like me at all. So I um, compromised and had an orange juice because I thought at least I'm going to get a little bit of vitamin C in. Um, I've tried my best this morning to sort of G myself along, but it's really not happening today. And I'm just now wondering if I've pushed myself too much this week to carry on with normal life to the point that I feel like my body's saying to me today, I'm just aching from head to toe. Um, I've got a headache and like a sinus headache and I'm just aching from head to toe. Obviously don't want to spend all day moaning like this. Um, <coughs> I'm not well. But um, I do feel like my body is saying that um, I need to slow down today and maybe I need to have a little bit of a rest. Obviously this is the times when you realise how hard it is that your partner's away. Because I could do with just having a complete duvet day, wrapped up in the duvet watching movies. Um, but as I've got two to look after, um, that's obviously not going to happen. Um, I seem to have lost pretty much well quite a lot of the definition on my neck I know you can't feel it but I can feel like I've seen a bit swollen here and um, like I looked in the mirror and thought I, like now you can see that that's me with my normal like that is practically one you see that all up there I don't know why it's like that um so yeah not feeling it this morning but I'm here, I'm at work. I've I've had to come because I've got customers, you know, customers who have placed orders. I can't let them down. So that is why I haven't just said, oh, I'm not going and, you know, spoke to them and said I'll speak to them another time about their orders because I can't do that. You know, I've got customers to see and I'm not going to, I don't want anybody to be disappointed, any of my little dancing friends to be disappointed or the mummies to think that I haven't sort of made the effort to come. So I am here. So I need to try and find my smile <laughs> um, and get in there. I mean, it's just a cold. It's just a cold. But I'm just, I don't know today. I mean, I had a really good night's sleep. <coughs> but I don't feel like I did. Freddie slept all night and got up till about ten past seven. So that's great, you know. I mean, he's two. And he slept like more than 12 hours. I was starting to feel, I felt like I was feeling better yesterday, but I don't know whether it's just a case that, you know, I've pushed myself all week, tried to keep going all week, and I don't know, I think my body's just saying, Do you know what, you just want to stop, you just want to stop and sit down. So I'm going to get into my first dance school and see if I can pick myself up, it's just not happening. So I'm just trying so, so hard, and then I've got some other dance schools to go to. Um, but today, I mean, I loved, I love coming and seeing all my little dancers on a Saturday and fitting their shoes and getting their leotards. Basically, if you don't know, um, I'm, we're a mobile dancewear store, so we bring all of the leotards, skirts, shoes, accessories, everything. We actually bring them to the dance school and sell them direct at the dance school. So rather than them all having to go to shops, they can get them when they're at dancing instead from us, which is great. We love it, and I love coming. Um, and I'm always excited on a Saturday morning to come in and I've never been like that. I've never been one that's wanted to work on a Saturday. But this morning I really didn't. And I've moaned on for nearly five minutes now and that's a bit rubbish. So sorry guys. Um, I'm going to get myself in now. It's absolutely pouring down with rain. If you can just see if I just turn around and see how rainy it is outside today. So if I do end up managing to have any sort of duvet, I've picked a great day because who wants to be outside in that weather? 
So hope everybody's had a good Saturday. Obviously, by the time you see this, it'll be on the Monday vlog anyway. So, like, you don't... You get a vlog on Monday, which is my weekend vlog anyway. So it might just be that this isn't on. But if it is on, then you know that you're getting a Saturday and a Sunday. I'll check back in with you guys in a bit. Hi, everybody. So I'm just back from work. And I'm just making a little bit of lunch. And I've just opened the new wraps um, from Tesco's. And I've, so I've cracked open the, the seal on it. But, like, the bag's still, like, sealed shut. Like, I can't get in at all. So I'm just going to have to rip the bag. That's so annoying though. Like literally that's just sealed shut, can you see? I've tried pulling it apart and everything, but it's just not having any of it. It's it's basically, it's been sealed there rather than above the, um, the line that you cut off. So that's really, really annoying. That's annoying me anyway. So I've just noticed this box, this tin sitting on the bench here. I'm thinking, what on earth is it? So I've just had a look inside and I found this. And so I've just shouted for my mum and I was like, Mum, what's this? She's made vegan brownies. <laughs> How good's that? <laughs> How good does that look? Oh my goodness me. So we're just having a little bit of lunch now. And then after we've had our lunch, we're gonna try the vegan brownies. I'm so excited, but how sweet of my mum to make a little vegan treat. Oh, can't wait. <laughs> Hi, you buddy. Gotta see my Hi, you buddy. I'm right here. Oh, is that your toys? Where's Madeline? Did up. There, Madeline. Ta da. Ta da. I'm in. Hey, Lynn. I die so broken. He's not broken. <laughs> My toes. He's not broken. Oh, you found your toes. Wiggly toes. Wiggly toes. <laughs> Hi everybody, morning and welcome back to our channel. It is Sunday the 14th, is that right? 14th of October? <laughs> Madeline's just going to have a quick check. Good morning yeah. Madeline. Good morning, it is the 14th. Excellent, good morning. Yeah. And we currently have a bat in the living room. Morning Freddie. Alright. You okay? Wow, very good. So we've just had quite a chilled morning really, uh, just got showered and dressed, hey, yeah. uh, <laughs> and yeah. Freddie's obviously a bat today, now Madeline is off out with her friends today aren't you, yeah, going to town. you're going to town, excellent, going to spend some birthday money, yeah. excellent, can't wait to see what you buy when you're up there, yeah, there'll be some good stuff on, oh dear me, uh, if you get a chance as well, I know that Fenix department store have now opened their Christmas department, <gasps> Oh my god. Yes, yeah. they have. They have. Christmas. We'll obviously be having a big trip up there, but Christmas yeah. Time. Christmas time is coming. It's Christmas Freddy. Nearly. Yeah. Nearly. Oh, you're all right. Yeah. <laughs> Good boy. What are you having, Freddy? Ghost crumpet. <laughs> Ghost crumpet, that's right. Let's see it. Wow. And mummy's got one too. There we go. And I'm having a cup of tea with mine. Well, what do you reckon? Do you like it? Yeah. Have you ever had a crumpet before? Yeah. Have you? Oh. You like it, yeah? Cool. And we're watching Miracle on 34th Street, aren't we? <laughs> what about Santa? And what are you going to ask Santa for? Presents. What present did you say you wanted? A jigsaw. A jigsaw puzzle. I'm puzzle. Clever boy, that's a lovely present to ask for, isn't it? And if you keep being a good boy, I'm sure that Santa will bring you that. Good boy. 
So if you saw on our vlog from last weekend, our weekend vlog that went out on Monday, we went to somewhere called Time Out Station, which is like a sort of flea market that, that they call it. Um, collectibles, antiques, there's food, drink, there's a bit of everything there. We're actually going to head back down there this afternoon um, as we're currently promoting the Adams Family Show that we're going to be doing. Um, and I wasn't going to go down today because I was obviously feeling really, really bad. Um, I didn't even know if we are going to have a weekend vlog, if I'm totally honest with you guys. Um, but we're going to head down there for a few hours and help to give out some flyers for the show. Um, and Freddie's coming down with us dressed as a bat. <laughs> so I'm actually feeling a little bit better today. It didn't take me as long to pull myself around this morning, which was nice. Wow. Um, and... I've got a bit of an itchy face today, but my nose is feeling a lot better. And obviously, you can see that Freddie is also feeling a lot better. Oh, my goodness me. It's a shame that you've turned your chair over like that. <laughs> wow, are you okay? Yeah? You've been a good bat today. Would you like to say good morning, everybody? Oh, are you a scary bat today? Fly, my pretty fly. <laughs> and he's away. Bye. Hi, guys. So that is us out the house. We're going to nip down to Time Out Station at the house of our friends, promote the show that we're going to be in. Um, well, that's if they need help. They might have lots of people already. Oh. Freddie is still dressed as a bat. Come and help, aren't you? Yeah. And I have just put on my blue, well, blue really it's quite a dark blue poncho like a little collar and i feel like cozy it's not too cold outside today um so i'm just gonna put this i thought i'd put this go. on let's go, and let's go to time on station yeah it's cold are you all cold are you yeah. well don't worry we've got your coat yes yeah, so we're gonna head down to time on station now have a little bit of fun meet some guys who potentially want to get tickets for the show um, and just have a little fun afternoon um, so hopefully I get a little bit of footage while I'm there and um, we'll see what happens. Catch you in a bit guys. It's the Christmas section. I'm in town with my friend Emma dear. Hi. And we've just been to the um to the comic book shops and we got some makeup as well and we're just heading to Casper's for drinks. Hi bubble drink. <laughs> I need it. So there we go. There's our flyers. There we are. So you've got the flyer, turn around so everybody can see. So we've got the flyers here for the Adams family. And Freddie, you're helping hand them out, aren't you? Yeah? You're doing such a good oh, job. No. So come and see our show. Well done. Just got the back of your head now, though. Oh, well done. <laughs> good boy. Thank you, Freddie. Well done. You're doing such a good job, aren't you? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well done, Freddie. You're really getting into this now, aren't you? <laughs> Head of promotions now. <laughs> the doggy yeah get a couple of them ready next time somebody comes past you're gonna give the flyers out yeah oh there's a lady coming get one ready can you get one ready want mommy to help there we are that's it are you ready good boy oh, Ooh, got oh thank you there's a lady come and say come and see our show well done Freddie good boy thank you very much <laughs> Good boy, well done. Of course. Sweets and chocolate. Oh, He's already got one. <laughs> Look who's back! Hello. Did you have a nice time? 
time? Is, yeah. Yeah? I yeah. want to the toys! <laughs> oh, are you going to show Madeline the toys in the Boots brochure? Is that what you want to do? What? Yeah. Done. Well, you can find them. They're in the back, Madeline. There we are. Why don't you go and have a look at them in the living room? And I'll put tea out. Hey. So you had some fun then? Yeah. Was it just hey. the two of us went? Yeah. Or was there more? No. Just me. Very good. Mommy. And have you got some nice things that you bought? Yeah. I'll have to show you. Excellent. You can't. I'll go and put tea out now, okay? Okay. Yay. Yeah, nice to see you, Madeline. Madeline, Madeline. I want them to see them And we've just been getting them to practice saying I would lie. So we just got back from handing out some flyers for the show at Time Out Station and Freddie is loving life right now. <laughs> Are you drinking out the bottle? What a clever boy. <laughs> now Freddie did have a straw but it got a little split in it. Um, I think it was my fault actually because I like pushed the straw in the bottle so I could put the lid on. Um, but Freddie's quite enjoying just drinking out the bottle there, aren't you? have a little bit of a chill and then we're going to be having some tea but Freddie decided he couldn't wait for tea so he's got another ghost crumpet so I thought while we're just having a little um sit down I was going to have another look through the Christmas gift guide from the <laughs> we all got yours yeah comment down below if you picked anything out of here that you would like or that you're going to buy for anybody else Who are you going to call? <laughs> Who are you going to call? Who are you going to call? I do this time. <laughs> Who are you going to call, Freddy? Wow, so you've got Monster Munch and a Spider. And what song are you listening to? Ghostbusters! Ghostbusters! Freddie, who are you going to call? <laughs> Hi guys, good evening, welcome back. I hope everybody's had a good weekend. Um, I'm just going to start off tonight by just apologising that this weekend's vlog has been pretty much quiet. Um, not non-existent, obviously, because we have got one, but it's not really been much to it. Um, obviously, um, and this is the last time I'm going to mention it, I haven't been feeling great, Freddie hasn't been feeling great, we've been full of cold and we basically yesterday afternoon um, we just kind of took it easy and I just try to take a little bit of time just to do nothing, um, which I said I was going to try and do all week but then I've kind of sort of perked up and then got on with things and then yesterday I really do feel like my body, like I said, it just said, you know what, do you want to stop? <laughs> so that's basically what we did, we just chilled out. Um, so today, as you've seen there, Madeline has been up to town um, in her Newcastle City Centre with one of her friends um, and I'm so, so jealous because she's been the Fenix Christmas Department. Now, if you don't know what Fenix is, it is a large department store um, and, oh my goodness me, they have the most amazing Christmas department every year. We actually go on a family trip to it, it is that good. Um, and I don't mind that Madeline's been, but I'm so jealous that she's been there and I haven't yet. Um, and obviously me and Freddie spent some time um, promoting the show that I'm going to be in, um, which was great. So Madeline's bought some nice things while she was in town. Um, and bless her, she's even got me something, I'll just show you. She got me some of this, which is red licorice. Um, this is like one of my favourite things ever. Um, if anybody's ever going to buy me any sweets like this red licorice, it's like they want to go for. Um, it does come in a huge bag, there's like 500 grams in here. Um, but I'm that much of a pig that I can actually sit and eat it all in one go. Um, which clearly isn't a good thing. Um, but as of tomorrow, I'm starting like a massive health and fitness kick. <coughs> it's not so much the food. Um, but um, I haven't really do. I don't really get a chance to do. Um, I don't get a chance to go to the gym anymore, um, which I haven't done since I've had Madeline and Freddie. Really, um, I was lucky in that when I was doing the producers, it was a really um, high energy show. There was tapping in it, there was dancing, there was a lot of movement. You know, so obviously I was practicing that at home. Um, and since I've come back from holidays, um, my body's very sluggish. Um, 
and been doing a lot and then with being full of cold as well um i've been out in the car i haven't really been outside just walking and things like that so tomorrow starts a massive health kick for me in terms of exercise i'm just going to straighten the camera up because i'm not really in the middle and that's really annoying me um that's better that'll do that's a bit better um so yeah i'm gonna be doing more exercise but i'm gonna do more exercise to help well I'm gonna like you mums out there are probably a bit like me and maybe you don't always have time to like sort of do a gym or um you know you have you don't have the opportunity maybe to go out for long walks things like that and um, but I'm gonna be doing like sort of what I call like alternative exercises um like I'm gonna um look at people on YouTube who've got short videos um I'm gonna be looking at things that maybe I can do with Freddie. So things that we can do and get out and about before the weather gets too bad together. Even things like just dance and things like that. It's all movement. I'm just gonna look to increase the amount of movement I've got. And then maybe you guys can follow that as well and maybe I'll give you some ideas. Um, I mean, just a little bit of background. I've danced since I was tiny, so I've always been quite fit. Um, like for instance, I can still do the splits. Um, and, so like when we're doing the last show, like I need to do the splits in it. So it was a case of like a quick warm up and then I'm back down in the splits. Um, so I've always been quite physically fit and um, from a dancing point of view. I'm not a very good runner. Um, and if I do do any running, it was always short distance, like um, sprinting rather than um, long distance, cross country, things like that. Um, so I know what I need to do um, to keep fit. Um, it's just, I think sometimes life gets in the way. Now, I'm not going to be over ambitious. Um, it's not that I think that I need to lose loads of weight, but obviously when you do start doing exercise, you do find that you do sort of tone up a little bit and trim down, um, which can't be a bad thing. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to start being a little bit more healthier in terms of on the exercise side of it. I mean, we don't live close by to um, the town centre, so I do really have to drive there which is fine, I don't mind doing that, but it's not like this, I don't live in an area where I can just walk, I mean I can walk to Morrison's, that's about a 30 minute walk, that's good, and on a nice day that's a lovely walk, but of course obviously the weather's not great at the minute, we've had a lot of rain and stuff, <coughs> um, but yeah, I'm just going to try a little bit more exercise, ready for the big man coming, because it's not really that long until Christmas, like 72 days or something now, which is amazing i'm saying or something it is actually as of today sunday it is 72 days until christmas why do i even pretend like i don't know that um so just talking about christmas if you tuned into the live vlog that i did um yesterday sunday um, massive apologies if you made it through that um because i was coughing a lot i'm so so sorry guys it's like the back end isn't it and it's like when you start getting that horrible tickly cough so yeah that's about it for today guys sorry that this weekend vlog has probably been a little bit disappointing um it's been a little bit disappointing for me as well because i like to stay in good health i'm not somebody that likes to be kept down but i did just need to take a little bit time out just to relax recuperate and is it recuperate is that the word yeah i think so um and get ready so i'm gonna catch up on x factor because after i finished the live video I came through Madeline wanted to watch Doctor Who which we watched now she's headed off to bed so I'm going to catch up on X Factor from earlier on and um, has anybody else been watching Doctor Who and um, what do you think second weekend what do you think of Jodie do you like her do you not like her <coughs> excuse me right now I'm maintaining neutral because I think there's only two episodes in and I'm not um 100 percent either way at the minute um, I know Madeline's got an opinion on on Jodie so far and I'm sure plenty of others are so comment down below um, and let me know what you think um, so guys I hope you stick with us I'm really sorry if you find this weekend's vlog boring um, but I have to put it out there that this is just what happened so please before you do check out give our video a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed to our channel please do so I promise you that the videos are normally better than this um, and do hit that notification bell so you'll know when we're going to be posting videos so do post daily I don't tend to go for the five o'clock slot as that is pretty saturated. I normally do mine a little bit later on, um, but that can differ in time, you know, just depending. So if you turn the notification bell on, you'll know exactly when our vlogs are going to be going up. So I hope everybody had a good weekend. Good night, sweet dreams, and we'll see you all back here soon. Bye.